China's former security chief Zhou Yongkang maintained an iron grip on the country for a decade. He controlled a vast network of secret police and spies. Now retired, voices throughout China are rising that he'd be brought to justice as a traitor to the people. Prominent Beijing-based human rights lawyer Pu Zhiqiang took a major risk when he publicly denounced China's former security chief Zhou Yongkang, calling him a quote traitor to the people. Quote. The message appeared on Wednesday on Pu's personal accounts on the Twitter-like microblogs Sina, Tencent, and Sohu. Pu wrote, quote, "After 10 years of this person in power, his poison has spread across the land. He is a traitor to the people." For the past five years, Zhou Yongkang headed the Communist Party's Political and Legislative Affairs Committee, or PLAC. It had jurisdiction over the police, courts, labor camps, and national security. Zhou's term ended last November, but his reign over PLAC has been blamed for pummeling China's legal system. Renowned Chinese rights activist Hu Jia had published an article back in 2007 saying that Zhou deserves to be hung for his crimes. When I was arrested in December 2007 and charged with subverting state power in 2008, my accusations against Zhou were used as evidence against me. Zhou Yongkang came into focus last year as the political scandal around Bo Xilai unraveled. The two are allies, and there were speculations that Zhou was grooming Bo as a replacement because of his equally aggressive security tactics. When Bo was ousted in March 15th, rumors flew that Zhou led a failed coup in Beijing and that gunshots had been heard near Zhongnanhai, the central government's seat of command. Posts containing these rumors were quickly removed.